John were friends. Don was a big beat, and John was a little beat. One day, Don and John went out for a walk. John was always behind Don. Don walked fast, and John walked slow. Wait for me! Called John. The two beats walked uphill and downhill. They walked here and there. They walked near and far. As they walked, Don said, "I am glad you are my friend." Me too. Said John, "Nobody has such a good friends as you, and those other beasts don't have a friends like you." Said Don. Help! Someone yelled. We're over here. Look over there. Says Don. Let's see if we can help. I've never seen so much fun. Says Don. I will help you, Mrs. Broccoli. Me too. Says John. They pushed on the curb. They pulled on the curb. Whoosh! The mud let go of the curb. <sighs> That does hurt, work. Now we are all dirty. Says Don. And I'm thirsty. Me too. Says John. Look over there. There's some water. So the beast got a drink, and they got clean too. Now I'm hungry. Says Don. Me too. Says John. I live near here. Says Mrs. Broccoli. I will make you some dinner. Go in and sit down. My chair is too small for me. Said Don. My chair is too big for me. Said John. Well done, said Mrs. Broccoli. Why don't you sit in John's chair? And John, why don't you sit in Don's chair? Don and John look at each other. Yes. yes. Let's do that. Then the chair will be just right. Thank, Thank you, you for dinner, Mrs. Mrs. Broccoli. Goodbye. The boy waved to Mrs. Broccoli and to all the little broccoli. I'm walking back home again, said Don, and I'm going to bed. Me too, said John. Yeah. Under the great big chestnut tree.